So yeah. hydrate because they're know. not going to let it slide. It's uh, it's kind of like why do we still allow a man behind the plate to call balls and strikes when we can tell oh. every time oh, exactly fuck. when it's in Dude, there? Here's what right? I want. Here's what I want. I want him to change the rule, but not tell the umpires. I, want to... <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I don't want. You know. You're you know. I'm 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 you know. It, 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 I'd watch baseball. Like, treat it like quiet quitting, where like, where like, like they don't tell the umps like, like, like for and until they figure it out on their own. They're just like. And Mark Goddard thought that uh, that was a strike when clearly we're going to see it was a ball. We're going to mark it's, it as a ball, but yeah. allow him to do his little silly dance and point. Look how confused he is. The runner took the base. Ah it's like, well, welcome ah, to everyone point duel. Everybody's betting on the ratio of percentage, like correct calls that you mm. got, like the plus or minus for um, umpire Marcus. I, and, 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 and like, I like, mean, I would love it if there was just um, a, a safety measure they had they had the laser strike zone however you want to do it they're ca fully capable of, of, of having a three-dimensional mm -hmm. perfect strike zone as the rules lay it out to be and 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 they have that and then they let's grade these umps you want the traditional game let's see how good the traditional ump is and if he falls below let's make it like high school 70 percent uh-oh guess what you old fat fuck who probably couldn't play ball in the 50s either you're done you're fucking Wait, done. The refs nope. aren't that bad. The umpires are they're bad. awful. They're awful. They're not they're right ninety five percent of the time. No, no. Well, first of all, there's this instance where the strike zone is different from game to game and from man to man. It like, is like it is, my strike zone will be different from. It's, it should it's my be. Opinion. No, no, no. Yeah. It should be, but it should be different from person to person. But it Which should is not from be batter the, to batter, but not yeah. from, right from from, from ump umpire to umpire. If there were yeah. three umpires standing together, they should all come up with the same calls. Because the three here, batters will have different batter. I'm not a baseball guy, but the strike zone is armpits to knees, right? Yeah, knees to ch but it's vague. So, How close to the knees? Where like what if you got long mm. knees? Like like who knows? <laughs> like I don't it, even know. No, that was so on they, the lower bit of the knee. All right, know. so I yeah. could be wrong about this, but my understanding was that it was it was like from the bottom of the letters on the uniform like 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 here to the the top of the um the the the, the knee. And obviously, if you have a short guy, he's hard to pitch to. That's how yeah. the rules work. But there's a three dimensional strike zone. You don't have to just go through a box. Yeah, you it's have, where the ball ends up. It's yeah. like if you have a you breaking ball that starts high, then there's framing and stuff. letters on your chest. I really feel like uh, Phillies, hire me. I'm going to redesign your uniforms and put your fucking letters on your <laughs> dick. <laughs> and, and the strike zone. Guys, we can't do He ain't got letters. Every ball is a ball. <laughs> has there, has has there ever been in baseball, professional baseball, a redo? Where like the where umpire like, did not know if it was a, and they redid it. I love. That I think so prior. Okay, so Closest yes, I can tell you. Ah, too close to call. Let's fire that one back. Right. Like hundred percent. Like, when I forgot whether it was a ball or strike, umpiring, umpiring major league, I made them rethrow the pitch. Yes, one time I was like, guys, <laughs> I just hilarious. anybody know? No, counts, <laughs> counts back to three and one. Throw it. Like, oh, <laughs> just do <you'll>, both. <laughs> you'll uh, you know, you'll often. I don't know how many. I've only seen it done with a check swing, but you know, like I check my swing, I pull it back. I, I haven't I haven't mm -hmm. come all the way around. The umpire behind me might say strike three, but you I can, can be play. I can I can appeal to the first base umpire, and he's always watching that. He's got the oh. good angle, right? He can see the head of the bat swinging around. I go to third if I was a lefty, and he can give the 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 spear. I can be like, no, he's safe. He didn't go around, and that's and we're good. Like, what, what do you mean go around? Can, he didn't move the, the bat. He didn't he didn't so, get halfway through the swing when you oh. when your wrists he, start to turn. He didn't. His bat didn't go too far okay. forward. You can you can start your swing because you need to be ready. But if you're like, oh, it's a ball and I can't hit that. That's a breaking pitch. I, I don't want that. You, you back off. You don't you don't go all the way around. You haven't swung the bat. It's not a strike. You didn't hit. You didn't swing at the ball. But it's hard. And sometimes guys will like go too far around and try to yank it back. And there's if oh, a man's yeah. standing behind you, it's not a great angle to tell if you went too far forward with something. Mm -hmm. That guy at first base, if he's watching, and he is, he knows. Okay. If you appeal to him in that instance. But yeah, baseball should. seems like the most natural, like, put a computer in charge of that sport because ever. Because someone sliding into a base can, or, or someone placing a tag um, is just such a big moment, right? Is this inning over, or is this a blowout now? That's what mm -hmm. it comes down to sometimes. It's, it's, I wish that there was a lot of replay. I don't mind replay. I don't mind it slowing games down. I want the... I want to see the bang bang play. We already get to see if there is a technic. If I have been able to, from my seat, tell whether it's a safe or an out without like 
you know, for the past like five years, then I know damn well you can do it at home. And what's Mm -hmm. frustrating is not even like, I don't think you need to put sensors in the ball. I think that will change the way the ball plays, whatever. Right. No, but I know for a fact, we have a better way of figuring out if that ball crossed the plate line of, I know like the goal line in football. Oh, absolutely. There's literally no way we can get more cameras involved. Like why is all of them like I are, have you watched, you've watched baseball like recently, they have a top down, Slow mo HD fucking IMAX camera or James Cameron is in the sky <laughs> getting that shit done. You see the ball c- rotating as it goes across the plate, and you're like, that's a dirty one, huh? Oh, look, a fingerprint. Yeah. They yeah. can <laughs> tell balls and strikes, and they can do it lickety split better than that old cocksucker who's collecting a check. Yeah. It's just I mean, for like, the sport, love of the game. I hate umpires. I hate umpires. I just want to be. I, don't, I just want to be right. I don't want there to be inconsistency. Like, yeah, whatever. There's right always going to be inconsistent. I mean, like, what what would you need umpires for still if they made computers for like the pitch? You'd still need it. You wouldn't well, need it for they, like safer they, out, right? You got grown men out there, you know, playing against each other in a sport. They're they're, they're keeping the peace and they're like keeping the game moving and as yeah. it, as it goes, they're they're handling the time and, and, and even all that. baseball fights where it and gets they're out still of hand. making the a calls. Of, they're just getting YI corrected. Autos. I don't think they should be calling strikes and balls. Um, they could, they should still be back there. I think probably if I'm being honest, like doing their thing, but when they're wrong, it goes bing. Oh man, I'm looking dumb. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. Like imagine that if, if he had to stand out there and get corrected. Oh, all that. that's that was the umpire now. paddler. And <laughs> then they, oh, the he's got to get beat, punish him. <laughs> yeah. Like, like, he shouldn't get paid if he can't hit 70%. Like for real, that would be, that would nah, be funny. Taylor's idea is better paddling. Yeah. <laughs> right paddling. And you have whoever the fucking mascot oh, of the stadium you. is. Yeah. You have yeah, the Philly the fanatic stadium mascot there. paddle the empire for getting paddled. And the Phillies fanatic is taking chase. <laughs> oh, look at Bob run. Yeah, those look at Bob. Are so no, he's, good, are they? He's uh, 81. He played catcher for the Orioles all through the 80s. Blew those knees out, and the fanatic is making quick work of him. Suddenly, oh. baseball would, baseball every would mascot be the best looks sport. like John Cena. <laughs> <Just> like, <laughs> <laughs> baseball would be the best sport in the world to be like super into. For it to be like your sport, so because much data. it is nonstop data. Yeah, good point. And content, like, imagine being a big baseball fan. He's like, I love the Cardinals. You get to watch 160 games, and that's and they're just all four your hours. And they're all four. I said this. Yeah. Baseball is the perfect sport for everybody who works a job in the like that where most of it is like staring at a parking lot. You're mm-hmm. loving baseball season. I mean, oh, there's yeah. in, there's just people talk. It's like old. It's sports podcasting. Just like literally halfway through, they're like, and the three so two right. pitch, it's a foul. Yeah. Seven minutes into this at bat, I'm gonna get a turkey dog. I've never had one before. What do you think about that, John? He's like, I went to Philly in '96. Well, <laughs> like, I'm gonna be on. I'm gonna be honest, Steve. I'm drunk. you're so right i just realized what i when i think back about like loving baseball i'm thinking about those summers growing up listening to it on the radio like all through the evening while we were working or like hunting or like doing something in between Mm -hmm. and and it it is like that you know they, they call the game but they're also just like i don't know about that guy yeah look at that fellow in the stands there is he is that a banana? No, no, it's Big Bird. He's dressed as Big Bird. <laughs> oh, and look, Marquise Grissom's going over to give him a handshake. Yeah, what a what a good guy. <laughs> you know, Marquise is doing some charity work down in the Dominican Republic in the off season. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. For uh, <laughs> one handed children, it's it's a terrible thing down there. The the cocoa farming. Chop the hands right off. Yeah, they do. Yeah, in fairness, All right, they suck at getting rubber out of the trees. Now for the 3-2 pitch. <laughs> Back to the game of baseball. <laughs> yeah, Actually, like- the game's been going while we've been talking. We figured you wouldn't mind if we just kept <laughs> <laughs> um, <It's> been- <laughs> Yeah. 